Hello everyone. Today I'll be going through how to install SQL Server Analysis Services 2012. There are a number of new features and enhancements in this version of Analysis Services. One of the major new features is the addition of the tabular model. When you install and set up Analysis Services, you have the option to install it with the multi-dimensional mode or you can choose the tabular model. The multi-dimensional mode is your traditional multi-dimensional OLAP structure. It's what you had in SQL 2008 and earlier. The new tabular model is an in-memory database that uses the X-Velocity engine for very fast access. It's not necessarily a better solution than the multi-dimensional model. The model you go with depends on your development and user requirements. One thing to note is even though both models are available for you to choose from, they are not interchangeable. A multi-dimensional database cannot be placed on an analysis services instance that's configured for the tabular model and vice versa. You can have both of these models on the same box, but they need to be on their own instance. The install process for both of these models is exactly the same. There's just one part where you need to choose which one to go with. For this video, I'll be installing the tabular model. To start the install, run setup. It will bring up the SQL Server Installation Center. Go to Installation and then New SQL Server Standalone Install. Let the setup support rules run through its check. Make sure there are no errors and click OK. Next, it will check for product updates and install the setup files. It'll run through the setup support rules again. Make sure there are no errors. Click Next. Here you have the option to install analysis services as a new instance or you can add it to an existing instance. I'm going to install it as a new instance. Enter in the product key or select evaluation version and click next. Accept the licensing terms. Select SQL Server Feature Installation. Here you can choose what you want to install. For this installation, I'm only installing Analysis Services. The other option you should install is the SQL Server Data Tools. This is previously known as the Business Intelligence Development Studio. You use this to create your Analysis Services cubes. I already have this installed, so I'll just click on Next. Enter the name you want to give your instance. I'll name it AST1 for Analysis Services Tabular. Click next on the disk space requirements. For server configuration, you can specify the account that will be used to run the analysis services service. Normally, you should use a domain account to run the service. Uh, since I'm just installing this on my test machine, I'll leave it as the NT service account. On the Server Configuration tab, here is where you can select which analysis services model to use. 
you can select the multi-dimensional model or tabular model. I'll select tabular. I'll also add my user as the administrator to this instance. On the data directories tab, here you can change where you want the analysis services files to go. And click next. And click next again. It'll run through the installation configuration rules, do a one last check, make sure there are no errors, and click next. You'll get a summary of the options you selected. Click install to begin the installation. The install usually takes about 10 minutes to run. So I'll pause this video and return when it finishes. So the install finished successfully. Click close and close out of the installation center. We can now try to access this new analysis services instance. I'll try connecting to it through Management Studio, which is located under Start, All Programs, SQL Server 2012, and Management Studio. Change the server type to Analysis Services and enter in the instance name. In my case, it's AST1 and connect. I'm able to connect and currently there's nothing on this new instance, no databases available right now. You can use SQL Server data tools to create an analysis services database. So this concludes this video on how to install Analysis Services 2012 tabular model. Thanks for watching.